All right, so guys, I'm back after uh, <laughs> that random cut because I just lost all train of thought. I did edit it out because, oh well. So, kind of left off on uh, just skydiving, talking like that. And so we talked like throughout uh, the spring, and then during summer it'd be funny because we just talk all the time. And like this one time we were at this uh, bonfire, and this guy Dan, he's always. Uh, like on our case about it because we never told anyone like that we were talking so he's just he's always on our case and the one time like he, he was like so when's the wedding or something like he just mentioned marriage between us and I was like oh it's soon or something like I just they expected me to say like what are you talking about dude but I just said like yeah we're getting married and like she totally went with this story and he was like what like he just like his mind was blown like it was really funny because like no one expected it and it was just great and so uh that was one awesome thing funny story but um then what else is there so then i left for uh boot camp and i was like oh man this sucks because we couldn't talk on the phone so we just had to write letters and getting letters from her was freaking amazing and uh it, i don't know she the one time she sent me this picture like with like a wig on and stuff and i was like what the heck and some guy saw it he's like dude what the heck your girlfriend's hair is pink and i'm like i guess so and uh and so he believed me i never told him i ended up telling him that her hair wasn't pink but hey it's whatever she's uh she's an artist she's super creative it's all that matters so um you know uh after like boot camp we started talking again. This is around like January because it was like three months long. Awful. But uh, when uh, we started talking again, it was really funny because I was at my friend Matt's house staying the night and uh, and so I was just, I remember I was laying in his bed and I was texting her and uh, it was January 31st and I was like, we, we were like gonna go to bed or something and I just said I love you like that was that was our first I love you and it was like uh, like I don't know <laughs> uh, so we were both pretty excited because I guess we just felt like it was a necessary thing at that time and still is but uh I don't really know how to say that hey whatever but uh so yeah definitely awesome experience so then I went off to uh more training and we texted like crazy always using Instagram you know it's, it's what we do that's our thing we just we text through Instagram but uh I love that by the way it's pretty awesome just like our own thing you know but um so let's see went to SOI that was so much fun and uh, weekends I'd get my phones back and oh my goodness, I would nonstop text her like crazy. Like I lived for the weekends because I would just go to this one place and I would just text her and we just text like all day. And it was so amazing just to like get to like talk to her and stuff. And uh, after that, it was like April second. Um, time really just flown by, but uh like April 2nd and I finally like got to live a normal military life and uh, then I got home um, in May I got some time off for uh, Memorial Day weekend uh, that was fun that was like when we went on our first ever official date it's pretty good a date like you know it was pretty awesome you think like oh they went out to eat no we just were like screw it we're gonna hang out in my car and it's gonna be like one o'clock in the morning. So May 23rd to 24th, that's what we did. We just, we hung out and we kissed. Our first kiss was like really funny because she was just sitting in the car. I hadn't seen her in like months. Like we FaceTimed before and like all that stuff and like sent pictures, but like face to face. And I was like, okay. I looked at her like I couldn't even hold it. And I was just like, I'm gonna kiss you right now. And she was just like, okay and then we just kissed and it was really funny like it wasn't smooth at all like it was just the funniest thing and 
my first kiss, best kiss ever, pretty good. We got better at kissing, let's be honest, <laughs> but uh, you know, that's just how it went down. And uh, that was our first kiss. And ever since then, like, we've been uh, just talking a lot, like, you know. And I'll, I came home a couple more times, and uh, <laughs> like people, they know. They like, there's the cat's out of the box, the door's left open, the chair's on a stool, the headphones are playing music, the bells are ringing, like everyone knew. Like, they were like, okay. Something's going on, but still, we haven't told anyone because that's just how we like to do it. We just like to make it a secret, so people are like, everyone like knows that I like Daisy and that she likes me. Well, not everyone, but a lot of people, and they're like, you guys should date, and uh, it's just funny. Like, <laughs> I don't even know. It's just really funny. So. um yeah, and uh, this one time, apparently Daisy was telling me, she was like, hey, like, you should have been there when, um, okay, so, hold on, let me go back before I tell you that story. So, whenever I come home, like, we go on these awesome dates at, like, night, it was like 12 o'clock at night, and we stay up till 5 in the morning. It's, it's, it's just great. It's our thing, and I love it. Like, it doesn't get any better. And so we'll like, we went to our church parking lot and we just swang, swang on the swings. <laughs> and, uh, and I don't know, it was just fun. I always, I try and swing on those, but you know, I'm always just like, oh, I swing for five minutes and I just like to walk around. And so, um, we were just swinging and she was telling me this one story and I forgot the story already. Nope. See, my mind's just not with it today, guys. But... Oh, yeah, yeah. So she was like, her friend was talking about it or something. Sorry if I get this story, like, way wrong. But uh, it was just so funny because she was like, she was like, yeah, I kissed this guy. And uh, he was clean shaven. And that girl just immediately knew, like, it was me. And apparently she had, like, grabbed her and just dragged her all the way to the front of the church. She was like, tell me all about it. And, like, it was just funny just to, like, hear that. And everyone knows, and like, but we still don't make it official because that's just how we play the game. We're just like, nah, this is what we do. So, definitely, I love this relationship, and it's like freaking awesome. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, that's really all I have to say. I mean, it's pretty great. Definitely recommend a relationship I'm not the dating expert don't really know what I'm saying right now so hey that's that's all I have for the video yeah all right guys I'll talk to you later probably make another video tomorrow because I'm probably gonna make videos daily from now on to the rest of my life so you know there we go